Well, Ricky, after the success of beating Harlequins, the holders last week, you go to your former club Bath this weekend and another tough game in the LV Cup. Yeah, you know, last week was a massively pleasing you know, performance and result for the club. You know, I think on all and on many fronts. You know, I think obviously you know, to beat Quinns at home in the first round of the LV and to to get a foothold, you know, obviously to hopefully progress us on in the competition was really good. Yeah, you know, to get the guys you know back up and running from some injuries and get them game time was really pleasing as well. And, and also just to keep the whole momentum of the club, you know, moving forward in terms of, you know, our, our winning mentality and, you know, hopefully when we get dropped back into the Premiership, you know, there's a real sense that the momentum is moving forward. In terms of the squad, you last week you changed the whole starting 15 and it looked as though it was seamless almost. Yeah, you know, each season obviously we're looking to strengthen and you know, this year it just shows we've got a very, very competitive squad and you know, I think you know, the side that was, was put out on Saturday shows how competitive we are both you know, individually in positions and obviously within in teams as well that I think whatever side we'll put out we're going to be you know, competitive and really, really going at it. Rob Hunter said after that uh, it's a case of these boys that are in it these next two weeks to put their hands up and show what they can do because we've got a very important premiership block coming up. Yeah, there'll be some guys that are obviously frustrated the, the amount of game time they had and you know, also talked about the guys coming back from injury so it's a good good mix to have, you know, some really hungry guys that want to go out and perform and you know, and put the, the, the shirt on and wear it with pride and I think it you know, just showed last week you know, in terms of you know, the performances individually and collectively that were put in that you know, it's a strong squad and, and everyone is competing for places. I know we won't talk too much about the Bath who do but in your preparation I'm sure it comes up that you haven't won up there yet, you haven't beaten them since you've been in the top flight. Could this be the weekend? Uh, definitely, I think yeah, we, we haven't talked about it. What we have talked about is you know, what's going to give us a performance. You know, we've talked about you know, going out there and attacking it from minute one, you know, going out there and playing the way we want to play and, and influencing the game the way we want to and not letting Bath influence us. So yeah, we know it's going to be tough. Yeah, we, we know that obviously in terms of results that we haven't you know, obviously got a win against them, but we know exactly what we need to do this weekend. And, yeah, the guys have prepared really well this week. Yeah, we know exactly what we need to do, and yeah, it's going to be a big, big physical encounter. Yeah, and we've got to go out there and match that. And if we can do that, and then put, um, pose our game on, then we know we can get the result. Like ourselves, we are going well. Bath are going well in the Premiership, and they've obviously done well in Europe and now the LV with their win at Sale last week. Yeah, I think obviously if you look at the crowd at the weekend to get 9,000 plus you know, for an LV game is you know, massively pleasing. It shows that. Yeah, with us and with Bath, when when you're winning and you've got a bit of momentum, you know, the the support will get behind you. And you know, we're going to go out to Bath as we can, knowing that they're on a roll, you know, knowing that their crowd will be behind them. But yeah, you know, yeah, what a place to go and play, you know. And I think we, if they've got a big crowd out there this weekend, there'll be two teams really going at it, and it's going to be a great game of rugby.